Hey guys, welcome back to another cash stuffing video. I've got a lot planned for today, so I hope you decide to stick around. Um, if you're new here, hi, welcome, my name is Kay. I am a zero-based cash budgeter, and on my channel, I stuff my bills, my sinking funds, as well as play some savings challenges and do some budgeting with me videos. In today's video, I am going to be cash stuffing my weekly pay of $928. I'm going to be doing a mid-month check-in on my monthly budget worksheet as well as play some savings challenges. So we have a lot to get to, so let's go ahead and get started. So I hope you guys have had a great week. TGIF, I'm always so excited when it's Friday. Work, I swear, is trying to kill me. December is probably the one of the busiest times of the year. Um, for me and my department at work. And so I feel like this month is just flying by. I have a lot to do today, so I just wanna get right on to it. Um, I first want to go ahead and talk about my uh, utilities for the month. Um, I was planning for high utilities, but for some reason, they're actually low again. So I am going to adjust my budget, maybe not on this stuffing, but the last stuffing of the month. And so I'm gonna decrease it. Um, and I also got my complete and actual picture for the bonus money I received this month from work. Um, so I not only got a Christmas bonus, which I did stuff in an earlier video, so if you missed it, I will go ahead and tag it here up at the corner um, and link it at the end too. But I also got a like five-year bonus. So we have a few milestones at work which is every five years they give you a bonus. And so the first bonus for a five-year um, employee is about $500 and after taxes is about $350. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get to stuffing it this month. And so if I don't stuff it this month, I will plan for it on, in January, which is great. Um, and because of the extra money, I went ahead and rolled over $500 for the month of January to play savings challenges with and to do my um, sinking funds. So, cause January tends to be a slow month in my side hustle gig, which is the house sitting and pet sitting. So I wanna go ahead and here and check off some goals. Since I, considering this my mid month check-in, I feel like this is all we need to talk about right now. And I did fully fund my anniversary, but I'm gonna to continue to stuff it because, hey, you can never have too much money when you're on vacation. Well, I guess you could, you could be spending more money, but I'm gonna try and come back with some money. And I am starting some of my 2024 um, goals for uh, collecting savings challenges. And my property taxes did get paid. The only thing I haven't done yet is know what I'm getting for my boyfriend's birthday. So <laughs> that is a big deal. His birthday is on the 12th of January and it will be here before I know it. So I need to figure that out soon. Um, but for the savings challenges, you guys, let me go ahead and put this away. I wanted first, before I get started with that, I wanna give a huge shout out to Priscilla over at Hot Mess Budgets. If you guys do not know about this girl, you need to go down to my descriptions and click on her channel and watch a few videos, subscribe to her channel. She is just so fun and honestly, the most supportive person here on YouTube. I have not seen anyone more supportive and on so many channels, watching videos and doing her part to watch. And she does this playlist challenge. She doesn't save for it, but she does a playlist challenge. And she's the only one I think I've seen do it as consistently as she does. And right now she is watching my cash stuffing playlist. So Priscilla, thank you so much. I see you on there. Thank you, I appreciate it. You are the reason my watch hours are way more than my subscribers. And so I will probably, because of you, be at 4,000 watch hours before I even reach 1,000 subscribers. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you so, so much. I love your channel. And I hope that I can get my viewers to go over there, support your channel because you are amazing. I absolutely love you. Okay, <laughs> so with that being said, I also wanted um, to show you, I got a little happy mail from Melissa over at Budget Save Repeat, I think. Anyway, she's been handing out her little Christmas cards this year. I have been seeing this little, oh, I don't know card stuffer that she has been giving everyone. I'm so grateful. Oh, here we go. Budget stuff, save, repeat. Melissa, thank you so much for my um, Christmas card. I'm going to be sending you one back. 
I hope it gets to you before Christmas. If not, please know that I wish you and your family the warmest of Christmas wishes as well, and you will get your card eventually in the mail. Thank you again. And um, some of the um, savings challenges I wanted to uh, share with you guys is, the first one is a channel that's new to me, and I think she's new to uh, YouTube, but it is Jen over at Teach, Save, Travel. She is a history teacher here, I think, in Texas, and she makes the prettiest watercolor savings challenges. This is one I printed off from her um, YouTube channel, and I think it was free for Christmas, so we are going to do this one today. And she has also um, created a Greece. I, you know, as you guys know, I am planning a cruise to Greece. I hope to get there in 2024, if not early 2025. And um, she made a travel savings challenge with watercolor images of the different islands in Greece. It is gorgeous. She's having an Etsy shop sell right now. I think most everything is half off. She's got a European vacation, a Caribbean vacation. Go check out Jen. I will have her information linked down below. But she um, loves guinea pigs and she had a guinea pig. I'm assuming it's a classroom guinea pig. I'm not sure, maybe it's a home, home guinea pig. But y'all don't know this about me. I love guinea pigs. They are the sweetest creatures on the planet. I've owned three in my life. Um, I love snuggling with them. It's just so hard for me. They live about three to five years and it's so hard for me to say goodbye when it's time to say goodbye to them. So I've stopped um, bringing guinea pigs into my house, but I love them. So this to me is the perfect, I used to have a guinea pig that looked just like this and we called him Nibbles. Um, me and my girls loved taking care of him. He was honestly the most loved pet in our house for the longest time. But she also, let me grab it real quick. Oh, I don't know what I did with it, but I got, I got one. It's called Love Pigs, and it's on her shop if you're interested in looking at it. I don't think I have it with me, but um, I got one for February for Valentine's Day. I also want to give a huge shout out to Candy over at Stuff and Budget. So sweet. Love her channel. She has an Etsy store as well, you guys. And she has a sister-in-law, I believe, who also has a budget channel. So head on over to her um, channel. Give her some love and support. But you guys know I love coffee. And if you are a coffee drinker like me, we don't uh, wake up or we don't, what is it, drink coffee when we wake up? No, sir, we wake up to drink coffee. So I bought two of her challenges and she gifted me the Starbucks one. I am going to be playing this, these savings challenges all in the uh, year of 2024. I absolutely love them. And she did give me permission to share this as a giveaway on my 250, or I'm sorry, 200, 750 subscriber giveaway. So whenever that comes, I am collecting for giveaways. So this is gonna be a part of that bundle whenever that happens. Okay, so I think I'm done with all of my announcements. Thank you so much for sticking through that with me. Today we are going to stuff my weekly paycheck and we should have $928 here. So we're gonna give this a quick count. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six hundred, six fifty, seven hundred, seven twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, eight hundred, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, ninety five, nine hundred, nine fifty, 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 nine hundred, nine fifty,
So um, we did everything on my grocery or on my grocery list. I got enough food to get us um, three planned meals that made double servings. So we had each meal, you know, six, you know, twice. And then I had enough also free food over at work. Holy cow. I'll send some pictures up on the screen because I know how much you guys love my pictures. I love taking pictures, by the way. So you're going to see a lot of my life in pictures. Um, but we had Patriotic Pig come to our building and the building that we have our offices in. They hosted a Christmas luncheon for us. So good. Um, and I am swear to God, I'm living off of coffee and Christmas cookies too as well. <laughs> Um, so let's go ahead and get stuff in. Gas is only going to get 10. And please ignore my nails. They are horrendous, but I have not had a chance to redo them. Um, dining out is going to get 10 as well. Me and Priscilla talk a lot about what we're eating on our health, health journey. And uh, Priscilla, I did kind of screw up this week. I did not do well. Uh, again, like I've been eating cookies. Like who, who does that? S salad and cookies, girl. That's what I've been eating. But I am trying to get back on the wagon. So today is a new day. Entertainment is getting 10 as well. Miscellaneous. Let's do that last. Groceries is going to get 20. No, groceries is going to get 40. Excuse me, 40. I planned for 40. Yes, since I am cooking more, I'm going to need more money for groceries. And miscellaneous is getting five singles. So we'll do one, two, three, four, five. And we are done with my pocket envelopes. If you are new to budgeting and are unfamiliar with the apps that we use to scan in our receipts, we get a little extra either in cash or points towards gift cards when we scan our receipts. So we love to do that. I did quite a bit this week. Did a lot of Christmas shopping, hit the grocery store several times. And yeah, so this is all gonna get scanned. If you need a referral link, I will have that information down in my descriptions as well. I'm gonna go ahead and just put this back in my wallet so I don't forget. And we are done with my wallet. Let's head on into bills and stuff my mortgage first. Mortgage gets $603 every week. All right, I am in love with the Vlogmas videos that have been going on. Um, so let's see, mortgage now has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eighteen hundred, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I think I want to condense these singles so I have some money to play some savings challenges. I'm going to put five ones down and grab a five. All right, next up is utilities. Since my utilities did go down, I know I'm not gonna need all the money that I'm stuffing in here, but I'm gonna just go ahead and stuff it $60 like normal so that maybe I'll get a little farther ahead in January. And so utilities now has 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 95, 96, 97, 197. And didn't we say my utilities only needed, what was it? Ugh. Utilities only needs 152, huh, for January. So we'll just roll over about $40, I guess. So I won't stuff utilities um, on the next paycheck. Wi-Fi gets a usual $17 to pay this bill every month. 15, 16, 17. So now Wi-Fi has 10, 20, 35, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. All right, car insurance. Let's see, is car insurance, it's gonna get $30 today. I am beefing up car insurance to prepare for my next six month premium. So let's go ahead and put a 20 and a 10 in. It's my last 20. And I believe one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred. Okay, I'll remember that for next time. So eight hundred in avocado bucks, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 95, 
100, so that's 900, five and six. 906 now in car insurance. All right, um, real quick. So I went ahead, since I made a November principal payment kind of late, I went ahead and did my December principal as well. So we're gonna rearrange this a little bit. So I do $50 every week in principal and extra principal and month ahead. So we're gonna go ahead and put the one, the 200 that I went already and paid in the principal account for December. We're gonna put this in my credit cards envelope. So this is gonna go back to the bank. Um, oops, I'm in my, okay. So this is gonna go into my credit cards envelope and that's just gonna tell me to take it back to the bank. And we are going to finish coloring both spots here for the month of January on my tracker. I went ahead and did that just to make one single payment instead of two payments this month since I was a little behind in November. And I figured that would help me out more in the long run. So for the year, guys, we are done with this tracker. I know I have two little houses here left, but I may or may not. This was me deciding whether I wanted to do an extra, you know, $100 towards the extra principal. But this here, you guys, is a year's worth of stuffing. And this makes an extra principal payment to my mortgage um, of, I think, $2,400. And what that means is that when you do that at least once a year, you are knocking anywhere between, what is it, three, four years to seven years off of your uh, mortgage term. So I have a 30 year term. So every time, every year I do this, I'm going to knock it down by at least a few years. So I'm anxious to over time see how this helps in my um, paying off my only debt, which is my mortgage. So I'm excited to report that the year of 2023 is complete and we will start on the year of 2024, maybe, maybe next week since I have extra money in utilities. So that means I don't need to color anything in my month ahead envelope, but I will be putting these 250s in here to catch us up, I believe, right? With 100. I may have been, yeah, and then next and then next week I'll put another 100 in and then we'll be spot on track for an extra $200 savings in my bank account. Okay, lawn care is getting uh, skipped, so is streaming, so is penny challenge, and here's my credit card envelope. And this is the envelope that's going back to the bank. Love cash, it's going back to the bank. Okay, we are done now in my bills binder. Let's head on into high priority. I can't remember. I think Costco is in here. Let me see. Maybe not. Maybe it's in the next one. All right. So according to, let's see. I am going to put 20 in my expenses envelope. Since I don't have a 20, we're going to use these last two tens. Okay. So we have an expenses, one, two, three, 20, 40, 60, 80, four, 20. Hope I did this right. All right, so next up is Costco, I believe. Let's go in here and see if Costco's envelope is in here. Yep, here it is, right here. Okay, so since we have some rollover, I did also budget to put an extra 10 in here. So I hope I did this right. I feel like I have less money than I ought to, but probably not. Okay, so we are putting the eight in here as well. All right, so now Costco has 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 35, 45, 50, Wow, 52, 152. That's awesome. I don't even think I need $152 worth of Costco, but you know, it's nice to have it in here. Okay, you guys, that's all I planned for this week. The rest here is the little bit um, that I never have a plan for. 
And we are going to start with my no spin challenge. I am putting money in here on my no spin challenge for the days that I did not spend, I believe. Yep. Okay, so I gotta be honest, I have not looked to see what I had spent money on and what days I didn't spend money on. So we're gonna just think about this real quick. So, what, you know what I'm gonna do? We're just gonna come back to this. Sorry to waste your time. <laughs> we're gonna come back to this because I did not do my due diligence and plan for that challenge. I just wanted to stuff money in here which I wanted to go to Jackie's Color and Save. I am excited about this one. I wanna color in some of these little truckies. They're so, so stinking cute. In fact, I'm gonna pull this one out. It's laminated just so that I don't bleed permanent marker on my desk. But let's see what money, kind of money we have left over in, in for our savings challenges. So we have five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen dollars. So that's right on track. So I think what I want to do is color in one, two, three, four, five, six trucks. So y'all sit tight and I will speed through this part. Okay, you guys, that was a lot harder than I thought it would be. <laughs> so I obviously don't take my time with stuff because that kind of hurt my hand even. Um, but yeah, I was just sitting here thinking as I was coloring just how amazing this community is. I'm having so much fun, you guys. Um, and I hope that I bring value to uh, YouTube. That is truly one of the things, you know, I enjoy doing this. This is a great hobby for me. Oh, I'm so glad at that. Look, I, I bled, so I'm so glad I did that. But um, I just want to say that I hope I can contribute just as much as I think the joy that I get from other channels. I hope that I can contribute that much, that joy to you guys. I mean, this is definitely something I do for myself. Um, it is a hobby. I, you know, would love to get monetized, but it's not something that I'm like super like, I don't know, like geared towards. I'm just having an amazing time getting to know you guys and feeling like a part of something bigger. And um, I love the way Jackie did her. She spent her time on her challenge, which is something I told her I wanted to do as well. So Jackie, I hope I made you proud. Um, but yeah, so I did want to get started on that one. So let's see what we have left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars. Let me see what I can do for seven dollars. Oh, we need to finish the 12 days of Christmas. What is even today? Today's the 14th. So, and I think you'll be seeing this on the 15th. So let me roll. A two is taken. Two again, one, five is taken, oh my goodness, seven. Oh my gosh, is that exactly what I have? It is hilarious. Okay, let me do a blue this time. All right, you guys, that's all I have for you today. I am going to see you again soon because I have a side hustle stuffing to uh, get ready for and i promise i will get my no spend challenge details together and we will pay what i owe for my no spend would you like for me to count what i have saved so far in fiona's 12 days of christmas so we have 25 6 27 28 29 30 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 38 dollars 
And this was a freebie from Fiona. I'm not sure if she has it linked in her um, in her channel, but it, it was it's actually really fun to play. So yeah, thank you guys again. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe. Hit that notifications bell if you want to be alerted to my videos when they get posted. And I will see you guys on the next Cash Stuffing. Bye for now.